into the hurricane theme of Bob. <laughs> Windy Valley. So, such great names for these levels. I miss the way they call them zones. Yeah. Dude, it's one of, it's one of my favourite all time Junction use to Sonic bits of music. I love it. It is a very Sonic 3D ish. Bow, 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 bow. Yep, remix of a Green Grove Zone. It's quality. Nice. I think Sonic uh, 3D was underrated. I feel like, yeah, the, the control system was a bit if, because I think the main complaint about that game was the controls wasn't perfect, Sonic moved too slow, and the special stages were too easy. Now, why I do just hate mine not so easy. Mm, uh, yeah. I actually, actually liked it. I thought I liked it. was great. Uh-huh. I haven't played the Saturn, I haven't played the Saturn version. The Saturn version is, is meant to be really good. Yeah, that had uh, animated cutscenes. Yeah. Although, the music in my opinion wasn't that good hmm I'll so what did oh, sorry, sorry. no I'm gonna go on Just... go on. I was gonna say like what did what did what did you think of like the, the, the racing you know aspect of these levels it's kind of weird for Tails really and also because Tails levels are only normally take a fraction of Sonic levels like as you see this level was finished in you know a minute and twenty two seconds, mm. which you know it's, it's you, you can really <laughs> I love that glitch tastic camera there. <laughs> yeah. Like if 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 you know what you're doing, you can like probably finish Tails' story with, with like an hour or something. Which I did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I actually remember once just that I, I got Dreamcast, but I didn't get a memory card about six months after I got the Dreamcast. Mm -hmm. So the. I, Start from the beginning. Every I, I would just complete the game, the entire thing in days. <laughs> yeah. The train aspect and like the fairies was always weird to me. It's just like it, it, it made, made made it too easy. Just this random fairy always saying go here, go there. Kind of like Navi, really. Yeah. But even more annoying. I never thought I never thought that'd be possible. Indeed. <laughs> Here we are back again at uh, Casino Polis. Weird names they put here. Indeed. And once again, it's just the standard, you know, it's, it's like when they validated that they cut out about, you know, half of Sonic's level and just had this little racing bit. Mm hmm. Then again, speaking of weird names, there is a Gigalop Gigalopolis zone from uh, Sonic Chaos. Yeah, uh, like the, the Master System games had some really weird names. Indeed. It was great. <laughs> I'll actually say I think the, the hardest level in history of all games has to be hands down Sky High Zone from Sonic 2 and the Master System. I was those playing that <laughs> Those hang gliders, even even as a seven year old playing that game, it made me it made me want to take my own life. Jesus, that that's how insanely hard those games were. <laughs> they control like shit, if I'm honest. Oh yeah. Well, let's be fair. The Master System wasn't an amazing console. Let's be honest. Well. You know, they could have made it at least control. You know. Yeah. Well, you think you know any any console that has the pause button on the console itself and not the controller, you know, it's a bit of a fuck up. <laughs> True. That wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. <laughs> I think his voice acting. If you compare his acting in this to SA2, he sounds so much better in this game. Indeed. He's, there's like a couple of lines in SA2 where he just sounds so terrible. <laughs> This comes out of nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> what did you think of, of Eggman's theme? Uh, it's not bad. It's, be it's better than his 06 theme. I love this thing. I thought I, I love like this, the the rock and uh, the saxophone. I thought he did it <laughs> together really well. Yeah, it's suitably jazzy. <laughs> They've just been sitting there all night. Which, in fact, if you play um, in Knuckles' this story, after you do the casino level, you actually just see them sitting down outside the casino. It's quite yeah. funny. <laughs> Did you notice there was a sound effect of a door just before they woke up? Really? Yeah, it was like... It was like... <laughs> <laughs> Is the uh, second cameo from Cream the Rabbit? Let's see if I can get it, actually get it this time. 
There we go. Oh, there. there we go. She, she flew into a wall, good for her. Oh, she flew over the building. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I did like the station square theme. The I have thought the station square was really bitchy and I thought it was really good. Mm -hmm. Out of, out of all three of the adventure fields, which one did you think was your personal favourite to go around? Probably Mystic Ruins. Yeah, I think Mystic Ruins was probably the biggest, because I mean, it had, had the, this area, it had the um, the like Angel Island section, and it had the jungle. Mm -hmm. and there's the rocks that just happened to break the uh, the second that you need them to. Yeah. Like, nice, nice and convenient there. Indeed. Now it's back to Ice Cap for a second time. The key is floating. Holy shit! <laughs> it's magic. <laughs> well, I thought there was an emblem in there. I love the fact that in these games, water there's like there's like no density to it. He walks just the same as he does out of water than when he's in it. Even the master, <laughs> even the master system games, you know, had gravity underwater. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Having Sonic 3 on the Mega Drive had the best version of that when Tails swim. When Tails what, sorry? When Tails swims in Sonic 3. Mm -hmm. Like, that's done really well. Wait, doesn't he do a doggy paddle? Yeah, he like, probably swims. The, the best thing though is when you try and, and carry someone underwater, his tails just basically break. <laughs> it's quite funny. See, I wish, like... Is there is there snowboarding in the 360 game? There is, yeah. Is it is it as fun as this, or is it like worse? It's fucking terrible. Really? It is abysmal. I'm not lying. Oh, oh man! Because no, like they have the snowboarding in this. You had the uh, the start of City Escape in uh, SA2, mm -hmm. which I love that level. Yep. I love the snowboarding bits of this, the ramps. Yeah. <laughs> so like, when you when you first uh, played this, Tom, like, were you a bit surprised to have like a choice of six characters? Not really. I was just like wanting to play the game. Yeah. Well, uh, I remember playing it, just thinking, who the hell is this cat and robot? Well, I just thought there were new Sonic characters, really. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Hi, hi, hi! Like, I, I love Sonic, but like, when you play his tails, he can get quite annoying. Indeed. Cause he can hey, hey, hey! You made it! That's pretty, just like, look how fast you're going through the air there! I think that, sweet. that ramp is the only way you can actually beat Sonic. Beat Sonic, yeah. That I think you get an, uh, a, a Game Gear game every 20 emblems. Yeah, it's like 20 or 30, which was ju it, it's just, just on, on the um, Dreamcast original. Why, it wasn't on the Dreamcast? No, it wasn't, no. Ah, uh, built for DX then. Yeah. Just like the uh, mission mode. Mission mode isn't really all that, to be honest. Mission mode is a part of crap, if we're perfectly honest. <laughs> Uh, introduction of Knuckles. I love his theme in this. Indeed. Hey, What's up? <laughs> Look, he's just like he just like going to beat the crap out of him. He's <laughs> just looking at him. Tails, you've done nothing to me, but I'm going to kick you upside your head. <laughs> <laughs> I know Tails is trying to be hard with Knuckles. Them's fighting words. <laughs>